Morning, Tony. Morning. Can you tell us, uh, firstly, how much the win over Newcastle has maybe lifted some of the tension, some of the anxiety in the squad? That was a great result. Obviously, the, you know it's important that you pick the results up, but you know I think you've got to take everything into context. There's you know the games in this league are so tight. Um, you need breaks at times, and you know we we played really well at Swansea and never got the breaks, and that happens. Um, but the lads have shown good character against Newcastle. It's a tough game for us, but we played very well and deserved to win the game. Three games in eight days. Quite a challenge physically and organisationally. How do you think? Well, it, it, it is, and especially without Solomon and um, you know James, who have done so well for us. And unfortunately, they've missed the three holiday games, which um, you know you need your full squad really to try you know to get through it and, and you know be strong enough to you know to be able to chop and change if you need to. Do you feel as if you're coping with that physically? Oh no, the lads have been very good. Yeah, very good. You know the the. Um, the medical department and everybody else connected with the fitness side of it have looked after the players this season. You know we've got um, you know very good stats in, in respect of um, you know what they're putting out week in week out. So there's there's no problems with that. Victor came off from Monday. Is he fit? Victor and um, Jonas will be late calls. We're not we're not sure. We'll give them as much time as we possibly can to see if they're fit. Um, at, at the moment, um, you know, we're still not 100% sure whether it will be a yes or a no. And in terms of this fixture, Stoke, obviously, with your connection. Oh yeah, you know, look, it's look a big fixture for you. Yeah, I look forward to you know, you know, hosting my former club. You know, great memories and, and everything else. And um, we know it will be a tough game, but every game in this league is a tough game. And, you know, I, th I think the, the results have shown that this year. You know, that the, there seems to be a, you know, a, 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 a not so big a gap as there normally is. Um, so it's a competitive league, um, as competitive as it's ever been. And um, you know, everybody will be, uh, I'm sure, you know, trying to strengthen during the window to make sure that um, you know they give themselves the best chance either to finish in the top parts where they want to finish, or make sure they're outside the bottom parts where. You know, it's very important for a lot of clubs. And in terms of your selection, you said Saido Berahino was lucky to make the bench on Monday. Um, yeah, that that was you know that's all done and dusted. That's, we've moved on from that. The kid came on and, and did really well for thirty minutes, and um, yeah, you know he's got a great chance of playing Saturday.